I'm uh, very, very excited and privileged to introduce a partner sponsor vendor uh, who's been a part of my career for the past five years, Otimo. Uh, I am gonna talk about them in a minute. However, I do wanna do a quick poll. If you are having a great time at Converge, raise your hand. All right, we got a couple of woos. You can, you can share, that's okay. All right, fantastic. If you know who Batman is, raise your hand. Okay, got a lot of hands, some hungover people, uh, I don't know. If you watch reruns of 60s era Batman episodes, Saturday nights at 1030 by yourself like I do, raise your hand. Nobody? I guess my son was right, Dad. You're the only one that, oh, we had one. Yes, awesome, my BFF, I love it. So the thing I love about Batman episodes from the 60s is they all start out the same. Commissioner Gordon is in his office, Gotham City's under control, he's chilling out, everything's cool, he's eating his breakfast, and Chief O'Hara bursts into the office. Commissioner, the Joker's just robbed a bank. Oh, jeez, can't believe that. I'm trying to eat my breakfast here. What's going on? A couple hours later, he's having a coffee. Chief O'Hara bursts in. The penguin has robbed all the animals from the zoo. And he's going to tickle the uh, pigeons <laughs> if we don't pay him a million dollars. He's threatening us right now. So what does the commissioner do? He picks up the bat phone and he calls Batman. So I like to think of we CIOs as the commissioner of Gotham City. For the most part, everything's under control. We're trying to keep everybody sane and happy, keep crime under, under wraps. But every once in a while, something happens and someone bursts into our office or they burst into our Zoom meeting. They say, hey, the infrastructure's down. We're having a massive outage. We've got a DDoS attack. Nothing's scaling the way we want it to. We're having a security attack. It's your problem, fix it. So what do we need to do? We have to pick up the bat phone. And sometimes we have our teams, they're great, but we need outside vendors and outside partners to help us. Otimo has been that partner for me for the past five years. At a former company, they took a two week deployment legacy infrastructure, took two weeks to deploy a tenant for a new client, and they developed it and re-architected it to a one hour push button, single push button deployment. That was my criteria, I said, I want one button to push. And they literally did that within six months. And it really changed the trajectory of our platform and got us to a SaaS model for this legacy infrastructure. Here at Three Pillar, we've been partnering with Otimo to really do microservices work, secured scale architecture, and really helping our clients take things to the next level. So whenever I need that outside support and I need that extra oomph to really take it, I pick up the bat phone and I call Otimo. So what I'd like everybody to do is, Raja uh, Gudepo is the CEO of Otimo. He's here, Raja, please stand up. Well, you didn't put the mask and the cape on that, that I was hoping you would. But as a sponsor, like Jonathan said, they, do, uh, they have paid for all our drinks and all of our food as well. So uh, thank you, Raja, and thank you, Otimo, for all your support. But I encourage you to meet Raja at some point over tonight, and uh, please get to know them because they're a great company to have. You may not need them now, you may not need their services, but at some point in the future, you're gonna have to pick up that phone, you're gonna need somebody to help you, so please, uh, get to know Otima. Thank you all so much. Enjoy the rest of the conference.